It's skills exploration days. The drive for us to move to a junior high versus a high school set is influential grades. Grade nine in particular is a very influential time for students when they're working on career development. Skills Canada, Alberta's you know, mandate is to promote trades and technology. So it's kind of the, the full scope. And, and so, you know, for us, we want young people to find something that they're, that they're passionate about. And so, you know, two-dimensional in a brochure, you know, is only so effective for us. We're looking at full sort of experiential learning opportunities. And, and this is very much reflective of that. So it's, it's hands-on, it's, you know, see it, try it, touch it, smell it, really sort of immerse yourself in, in these things, get hands-on with it. And that is really where we see the light bulb sort of turn on for young people, where, you know, in a traditional high school or, or junior high environment, there, there may not be shop classes. You know, there may not be access to these types of things. And so this is an opportunity where you're going to get exposure to a dozen different skill sets, opportunities, and, and, uh, and, and workspaces where they can do some of that early exploration. So for each one of these event areas, you've got that technical volunteer base that's here. So all of these people are accredited volunteers, they're either working at Nate and Sade or in the high school environment. They all have a background and a passion in these areas to be able to share that to young people. So we already know that if they're from high school, they already know what's being taught in curriculum. So this is totally integrated within the junior high curriculum or the high school curriculum, or if we're dealing with apprentices at that post-secondary level, right? So it's, it's all integrated. We're, we're dependent on them. We build the house and they bring the expertise to show to the young people.